Mr. Nut Job. As you down to his ears, they're all sticky. <laughs> Wanna come out? This is Squirrel. Squirrel was from our first litter of baby bunnies. And we had, I think there was six. Was there six bunnies in that litter? Mm, something like that. Something like that. Um, How many babies all together? Um, and I'll count them as I put them back here. Moving <laughs> slow. Yep. Oh, There's one. Let's get close to that guy. Look at that little bunny. Okay, there's one. I think they're cuter when you're they're your own rabbits. <laughs> Look at that scrawny little guy. <laughs> the little green one. Poor. Mm -hmm. Five. Five. Six. Boy, we really <laughs> increased our rabbit production. That's uh, six new rabbits we weren't expecting. <laughs> That's a good bunny. What a good little bunny mom. And his mom is Daisy over there, and he was just the friendliest bunny out of the whole litter of bunnies. So he would always be the one at the door of the cage and would be very curious and sticking his little face around and going like this and he still does this all the time if you're out there he's at his door going like this trying to figure out what you doing what you doing <laughs> <laughs> and he makes little oinky noises which is funny he's always oinking <laughs> um but when it came time to butcher the baby rabbits they weren't babies anymore but when it came time to butcher them and put them in the freezer I just couldn't bear to see little squirrel butchered he was my favorite and he was so cute and sweet and things and so we saved him to the last and then I was just holding them one last time and we just couldn't do it so we ended up keeping him um, just because he's so friendly and entertaining and I thought well that's kind of a good bunny to breed into our future bunnies so is to have this nice friendly bunny unfortunately we don't really know Ouch! he bites sometimes when he's tired of being out um, we don't really know what kind of bunny he is we know he's at least part New Zealand, which is what all our rabbits are, is New Zealand reds and whites. But because when we got Daisy, she was supposed to be just a female rabbit, not a bred female rabbit. So I'm, I'm not really sure what she was bred with. I suspect it might have been a Rex because the lady who I got them from had been toying around with the idea of breeding her Rex rabbits with a New Zealand or getting more New Zealands and breeding and trying to figure out what she was doing I guess but I think she mostly had Rexes and so I think probably what happened was that she was getting out or somebody else was getting in and we got a rabbit that had just been bred because it was literally like 30 days after we had her that there were baby bunnies. <laughs> so that means about two days before I picked her up <laughs> she had been bred so um, yeah but 
we really like him. He's he's a good big bunny. You saw how big he is. And he's got nice soft fur. He is kind of a stinker and is a little obnoxious now that he's an adult bunny. He still likes to kind of be pet on and he'll sit here at the door and wait for me to open it and play with him again. He likes to have his little ears scratched. So he's very friendly. He comes right up to you and wants attention. But he also is insistent upon that attention. So we used to have him over by with in the open cages and I decided I don't like having him over there because when I'm talking to the other rabbits he will jump up and go like this and pee on you <laughs> and it's gross it's really gross to have a rabbit that can spray you so we didn't want to have that over over on the other side where it's really easy for him to do that so down here it's a little lower and hopefully it will deter some of the peeing action he'd been mischievously getting into um but he is a very sweet and entertaining bunny um he's definitely got more personality than all the rabbits put together except maybe his mom daisy daisy's got her own personality too <laughs> she's one of those who's like come see me or i don't want to see you right now i will smack you <laughs> so she's she's got personality too but he's he's just a really sweet guy he's very funny he likes his his cuddle time so yeah so that's why we decided to keep squirrel and squirrel store here on our farm yeah my favorite story about squirrel was um when it came time to feed the bunnies as babies squirrel was more interested in attention than yeah. the food he would just just want to be you know around people yep he was a people rabbit from the beginning and still is definitely our friendliest rabbit yeah Go where nobody has gone before.